Welcome to Pathways of Hope. And today, the Gospel is taken from uh, the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 13, 53 and following. And when Jesus had finished these parables, he went away from there and, and coming to his hometown, he taught them in their synagogue so that they were astonished and said, Where did this man get this wisdom and these mighty works? Is not this the carpenter's son? Is not his mother called Mary? And are not his brothers James, Joseph, and Simon, and Judas? And are, are not all his sisters with us? Where did this man get all these things? And they took offense at him. But Jesus said to them, A prophet is not without honor except in his own hometown and in his own household. And he did not do many mighty works there because of their unbelief. The Gospel of Our Salvation Because of the unbelief of the people in the hometown of Jesus, he was not able to perform his mighty works. For us who live in a Christian nation, the Philippines, or some of you out there are living in a country that uh, has a lot of Christians, we could fall into this trap because Jesus is with us. He has already found his home amongst us. And yet, isn't it true that many times, like the people of the hometown of Jesus, we question who Jesus is and we sometimes wonder and maybe even think that he is just an ordinary reality in our life. We begin to doubt what we believe in. And Jesus is warning us, be careful. Be careful of that unbelief. That unbelief that would cause you to say, hmm, let's just forget the Lord. Let's just live the kind of life that we want to live in forget him and not even try living a holy life or trying to love the people I'm supposed to love. Let me just forget and just give up. And the Lord in this story is warning us, I cannot work my mighty works because of their unbelief. The invitation for all of us again and again as Christians, in the ups and downs of life, is to keep on believing. And as we keep on believing, the Lord will continue to do mighty works in our life, only if we believe. God bless us, and may this uh, message uh, encourage you today. God bless you.